So, this is actually my third go at this video. My first go at this video, I did uh, 10 minutes of gameplay and then realised that my microphone wasn't working. My second go at this video, my microphone was working but the volume was all weirded up. So, this is it. This It's do or die. It's now or never. So, this is DC Universe Online. This is the, uh, the villain's uh, headquarters in Metropolis. Uh, this is my villain character. Her name is Toxic Moxie. And you can tell me it's not a great name, but you will be lying. This is Toxic Moxie. She is a sorcerer, which means that she can summon a guardian, if that's what she feels like doing. And she has the power of flight. So that is her movement power. So this is obviously not the absolute beginning of the game because everything was conspiring against me. The other thing that's conspiring against me tonight is that my internet connection is really, really dodgy because it's been raining. So um, you may get to see the disconnect screen. Now, I'm just going to see what I should be doing because I'm level 4 now. Speak to Brother Blood's cultists in Chinatown. So I'm going to track that. An excellent start. Now... The Sentinel base is guarded by a protective spell, which So I'm just going to go to Metropolis and completely ignore thought. the voice in my head. <laughs> Find Brother Blood's cultists. They'll give you... So, uh, what I should also say is that what I know about the DC Universe can be written on the back of a postage stamp. Uh, I am not up to the minute on all the characters and the locations and everything, so uh, you know you'll have to forgive me if I if I don't seem to know what's going on because I I probably don't know what's going on. So I'm going to now find my quest dude guy. So the basic storyline is that uh, good and evil are still kind of opposed to each other, obviously, but they're also joining forces to battle against Brainiac. And when you actually start the game, you start in the spaceship, Brainiac spaceship. That might be one of them. I'm not sure. Uh, and then you have to battle your way out, and it's all very uh, shouty. Uh, it's quite fun. I was terrible at it. And that's obviously the tutorial where you learn your moves and your powers and stuff. I am not good at either the moves or the powers. Is that who I'm talking to? Speak to Brother Blood's cultists. That looks like one of them. So I'm going to see if I can show you some combat so that you can laugh at me. Shutting down the world in 25 minutes. Fantastic. Your timing couldn't be better. I've done that. I did that yesterday. Oh, okay, buy replay patches. So I don't want to talk to you then. I want to talk to somebody else. Probably this person. Maybe? It's graphically really cool. It's a cool game. And now I'm under huge time pressure because I only have 25 minutes and I want to show you the other character because she's all fun. Um, a bit low flying there. Doesn't it look nice? It looks really uh, nice. Doesn't it look great? It looks great. Doesn't look nice. I'm going in the wrong direction. I sometimes wonder when I make these videos, people who know how to play the game, I wonder if they watch in despair as I um, as I shuffle through their game fairly incompetently. Uh, I'm going back over here. I'm just going to go back over here because that's where the big yellow arrow is pointing me. I don't know what that big shiny thing is, but I bet somebody else does. All you nerdy people. Well, it's the X on the map, but how, do I go in there? Can I go in there? Shall I try Shall I try going in there? I don't think I can go in there. Nope, maybe on the roof. Roofy, roof, roof, roof. Ha ha! Where else would you find a friendly neighbourhood blood cultist? Am I not holding E? Have I disconnected? I have disconnected. We'll just see if... 
my internet will come back in time. And that would be a no. And I'm back. So let us see if... You Cersei's new spell slinger. This'll suck the good right out of the pure heart. So I have to steal Vanguard souls and harvest innocent essence because I am evil. Oh, I'm now, such a bad girl. Use that gem to drain essence from the innocent. Enough essence, and you can enter the Sentinel base and steal the demonic. That's eyes. the goddess Cersei. Oh, laundry. Uh, who is my mentor? Because you choose your mentor when you create your character. And so, I am presumably supposed to smack some citizens around, which is fairly evil, but on the other hand, I'm a villain. So just let me get my guardian out of my pocket. There are combos you can do to activate your powers, but I cannot get the hang of them. Who are you supposed to be? I give, I give! Look, do whatever you want. I'll stay out of your way. Whoa. I don't even know what that power is, but I'm sure it's quite good. So, uh, I'm just going to go around and smack no, some more citizens. I don't want to donate to your stupid charity, so stop calling! Oh, wait a minute. You think you can just attack me, sentry? <laughs> so, the thing about the Guardian is because I'm a sorcerer. I'm a sorcerer with a stick. Which is the most dangerous kind of sorcery. Yeah. So I've got 20 minutes till world shutdown. Oh, so rude. You shouldn't have done that. Nice outfit, freak! Get lost! Please stop! I'm sorry! Look, whatever you say goes, okay? Well, I'm smacking them around, but I don't know if that's really, um, helpful. Defeat the Sentinel Vanguards, rough up civilians, and drain the essence from the innocent. So you must be a civilian. How about getting roughed up? Oops. It helps, I find, if you face the direction that your enemy is in, rather than just um, swinging your stick around your head. He hasn't even noticed that I'm... Hang up your phone! Pay attention to the world around you, citizen! trouble with people today. They're so obsessed with who they're talking to, they don't even notice when they're being smacked in the back of the head by a fairly well-dressed villain. That's how that works. Look, jerk. Get out of my face! I guess only some of them can be, um, drained and the rest of them have to be smacked around with a stick. The quests pretty closely mirror each other. So, um, make you. it really doesn't matter which side you choose, because at least in the early stages it's some um, sort of variations on the same quest. I think my hero is on this quest, but for the, for the good side. I'll have a look in a minute. Why are you doing this to me? I do like the red swirly effect. I wonder if I can get one of those in real life.
So I'm just going to smack around a couple more citizens. And then because the world is shutting down shortly, I will... Oh, you vanguard suck up goody goody two shooters. The other thing is that you don't actually die in this game, you get knocked out and then there's this timer and um, then you can flee. I'll actually show you that by not resisting, although I have got a guardian so that might not help. Um, we'll see if I can get them to kill me. So that I can show you the deathy thing, except my guardian's pitching in because my guardian is there to guard me. I don't have time for this. When in doubt, just wave your stick around. It's all good. So I still need Innocent Essence. Nice outfit, freak. Get lost. I wonder if that means he's not innocent. Sure, I'll help you move. What the hell? Oh, I see. If you drain the nice people, um, then you get the innocent essence, because only oh, no, nice people are innocent, here. or only innocent people are nice. This is a waste of time. Portalis, Travis. Look out! My outfit freak. Get lost. Oh, it burns. I don't know who the purple fairy was. I don't even know if she was good or evil. Oh, you haven't got a big globe. Look, jerk. Get out of my face! Oh, right, have a smack to the head. I'm sick of people like you being okay, shouty. Look, I'll do what you want. Despite my inherent evilness, I have a top hat. A little bit of respect. Get lost before I make you. Alright, so I just want to show you. Disperse and trouble these people no more. I warn you. <laughs> Alright, um, I'm going to get out of that and then I will show you my other character who does not have the power of flight but she has, I think, the more fun power. So I'm just going to pop myself safely on this roof here and switch out. You get two character slots on your free account. Oh, and then you have to wait ten seconds. I'll edit this bit out. Maybe. And again, maybe I won't. Who knows with me. So you get two character slots, like I just said like 10 seconds ago. So I've got Toxic Moxie on the evil side, I've got Torch Burner on the good side. Don't tell me that's not a great name either because it is. You can add character slots if you want to pay money. So they're both level 4. My mentor for Torch Burner is Wonder Woman. My power is fire, my weapon is brawling. Although I did notice that you can actually choose other weapons which I thought were locked because I hadn't paid for downloadable content. So um, I don't think I'll re-roll her though because I'm pretty tired of that spaceship at the start. That's Superman. You may have heard of him. Right, so this is Torch Burner. One of the things you can customise is your stance and that's me standing. Uh, now, I'm see I'm on the same... I'm on pretty much the same quest. I don't have a guardian though, so uh, let me remember where I'm going, which is over here. So I don't know if the quest split later on or what. I'm fine, I'm okay. So she can't fly, but she has got acrobat acrobatics, which means she can climb basically any wall you like. 
which is kind of way more fun than you'd expect. It's fairly fun. Uh, there's also super speed. Which I don't have because I've only got two slots. Now something that happens when you're a hero that doesn't happen I don't think when you're a villain, although I haven't seen it happening when you're a villain but it might happen, is while you're hanging around town doing your hero-y things you do get the chance to... Get away! Why? Can a guy catch a break? Interrupt criminals in criminal activities. Damn. This is so unfair! Run. Run. That wasn't even one of them. That was somebody else for another quest. For so let me find one. Are you a bad guy? You look like a bad guy. Uh, let me find a mugger. And there isn't going to be one, is there? Because I'm actually looking for one. So basically, yeah, you, you can run around and while you're doing hero-y things, you can swoop in and save the day. Which is a very hero-y thing to do. Assuming you can find a mugger. Oh yeah, this is my quest area. I'm supposed to be killing people in this area. So, um, I'll come back to that later. Oh, I've got, yeah, fire. So I'm a fiery person. As well as a punchy person. I do set myself on fire, which doesn't really seem like the wisest course of action, but, you know, I suppose for shock value it's pretty good. I am basically now just running around looking for a criminal so I can arrest him and impress you with my uh, amazing heroics. They tend to be muggers and car thieves. You've got to stop them. So, that's really it. It's a fairly, um, well, see, I don't really know because I'm only level four, but it's a lot of fun so far. So I think I might actually stick with this, but I would recommend if you do see, um, <laughs> if you do see Torch Burner or Toxic Moxie hanging around in Metropolis, then perhaps don't invite them to group. <laughs> because I don't think it'll end well for you. I think that, that would be um, definitely a way to get yourself very swiftly killed. So, I'm trying to stop them. Where are they? Tell me. Everything's nice in the park. I haven't figured out these things yet. I find a few of these things. And I don't really know what they do. Oh, I got a Sullivan Lane. Well done, me. I'm both pleased and proud of myself. So, I am going to shoot up a building. I mean, I'm going to climb up a building. I'm not actually going to go and shoot up a building because I haven't got a gun. Um, but, yeah, basically the game is free to play unless you want the extra content and... Um, extra powers which are available to paid players through via downloadable content. I haven't really looked into it. I'm going to go up here though. Uh, yeah, shutting down the world in seven minutes so I'm, I think I'll probably end this video here and we can be pleasantly surprised that my internet only went down once. Oh actually I'm not going to end this video here. I am going to show you the headquarters for the good guys. which are over here. Somewhere? I just saw the big purple glow. Where did it go? Alright. 
vantage point. I have to admit, I love this climbing thing. This climbing thing is brilliant. Huge fun. Huge fun. Aha! Big glowy green thing. So it's all happening in Chinatown at the moment. There we go. Any villains around? No. So, um... This is the Good Guys headquarters, which is a police department rather than a... a seedy club. So it's kind of less fun, I have to say. This woman, I keep seeing her around town. I want to tell her she needs to put some pants on. That is too much of a short skirt. I don't approve. Trousers, please, madam. Especially if you're going to hang around with the good guys, like me. Chrome Geisha, what a great name. So, now that we're inside the good guys' uh, place of good guyness and we've got five minutes before the world shuts down, I will say goodbye for now. I will see you next week with something else. I don't know what yet. If you have any suggestions, leave a comment on the blog post or leave a comment on this video. Um, as long as those suggestions are polite and not anatomically impossible. <laughs>